Hello everyone, uh, welcome to my channel Andy Learn and Share. I hope you all are doing well and you know all of you are staying at home at the moment. So this is a new video that I have come after a long time because I was quite busy in some other my coming friends. So I thought like you know the importance of this video at the moment, the people who are into roti process automation and how the scope of roti process automation after this COVID-19. So this is kind of a predictive video you can say that I have uh, you know, gone, I have done a few research that I have gone through various newspapers across the world, you know, through Google and also some other websites. So this is my small effort to, you know, make you aware that how the market will be after this COVID-19. So if you like this video, then please subscribe my channel and also like this video and also pass your com comments uh, over, uh, you know, over the sections below. And also, I would request you to please share this video to your uh, colleagues who are looking uh, for a chance to RPA or who are aspiring to you know join the roti process automation. So, how the world will be? You know, obviously, after this COVID nineteen, the world world will be totally different. As you know, that currently we are uh, in a, a recession like situation at the moment. So, I have taken a, you know very snapshots of the newspapers that I thought like you know it will be relevant for all of you to go through at the moment so you can see i have just referred some of the top newspapers and they are heading how the world and the and how the current economies of the world you can see that development economics could see sapper recession in 2020 so this is a, a warning from the world bank so all the major industries are currently uh, not working at the moment because of the social distancing and COVID-19. So our president, Mr. Trump, has said that you know greater recession is coming. Obviously, 2020 is not a, a good year for us, uh, especially who are into these industries or you know IT sectors or be it any sectors. And you can see the next one is like coronavirus pandemic. 75 percent of TCS walk walk was to walk from home permanently by 2025. This is as per a report. So you can say this is uh, one of the largest IT company in India. So they are predicting that you know seventy five percent of uh, their workforce will uh, work from home if, by twenty twenty five. Before lockdown, you can see only the twenty percent of the company used to work from home now because of this lockdown. I guess ninety to ninety five percent of the uh, you know workforce workforce of all the major IT companies or be it any sectors they are working from home. So also you can see that the industry is hit hardest by the coronavirus because you can see the company like aviation, <coughs> sorry, aviation sector, hotel sector, sports sector, or you know, food and restaurant sectors, uh, they are you know, kind of, uh, uh, you know, hit by this coronavirus because of social distancing, people, they are not traveling, they are not going out. So those kind of industries, they are being hit by this coronavirus. So obviously they will kind of look for a, solution in the future, you know, how can they bring um, back their economy back into the track. So most of the companies, you know, who can see that, you know, their work has been done and, you know, by, by, a, by a human being and all those kind of work are kind of repetitive, then obviously they will try to adopt the robotic process automation in their systems. <clears throat> so uh, since uh, this video is uh, mainly focused on the robotic process automation. So I have taken some of the top, top news from the market on robotic process automation. So you can see on the first, uh, the US government continually supporting RPA. Uh, yes, currently they are, not currently, but for the past one or two years, most of the governments they are supporting RPA because, you know, it will bring, uh, you know, there are various factors or, you know, there are various uh, advantages of uh, using RPA in your current industry and I, I, I think you can refer my other videos how the robotic process automation will help industry to grow economically. And also you can see that Mark Harvick, research director at analyst firm Tech Market View said that COVID-19 lockdown could see accelerated adoption of digital and automation technologies and it totally we have already seen over the last few weeks rapid adoption of RPA in a wide range of industries from healthcare to insurance as organizations you know get to grips with the challenges of COVID-19 and the lockdown and you can see on the second para the Singaporean bank OCBC has reportedly been able to use RPA to reduce the amount of time required to pre 
to reprise home loans from 45 minutes to just one minute, you can see that you know how the RPA adoption has helped one of the uh, you know major Singaporean bank. And the third one is 2020. You can see what spread use of RPA in mortgages. What applications can involve over 700 pages of agreements and legal documents, which are not only expensive and time-consuming to process, but also error-prone. Because you know, if you are bringing the robots or you know software robots in your industries, then obviously it will be kind of error-free because they will work you know whatever it has been programmed. So, so that is one of the advantages. And also, you can see RPA predicts in 2020 how COVID-19 will transform the automation landscape. So, folks, as you know that, you know, so many new industries, uh, they are coming into market and they would obviously like to adopt robotic process automation because because of this social distancing, you know, people now will be scared to go outside and, you know, they will obviously avoid the big gathering and, you know, adoption of RBA will bring uh, so many advances, advantages, for, you know, for them because, you know, they can run the robo over the cloud or over the virtual machines, you know, they don't have to physically go and work, you know, if they are doing some kind of uh, autom uh, repetitive work, then obviously, you know, automation or road process automation will be a very probable solution for those kind of industries. Moving to the next slide, so what are the road uh, So, you know, what are the f what will be the future look like? Anyway, any, anyway, you know, nobody has seen the future, but uh, what I would say is like, you know, if you are already into RPA, I would request you to please risk, risk yourself and learn the latest trends in the market. And if you are willing to learn RPA and you know, if you are aspiring to join the process automation, then you can obviously go through our videos in this YouTube channel and also very short videos in the YouTube on the robotic process automation. And also you can learn the uh, you know, robotic uh, process automation tools academy, uh, which are free and you know some of them are chargeable and if you are an industry or a company and if you are looking for IP adoption in your company or project or you know industry then or if you are looking for RPA training then you can obviously contact us for the details uh, you can email me on my food yoga mind at the gmail.com or you can obviously give some you know comments uh, on, on the section below so thank you for watching my video uh, I would request you all to, you know, stay at home, stay safe. And if, uh, unfortunately, if any one of your, you know, family member or colleagues or friends, they are not well because of this coronavirus, then I would, uh, you know, pray or I would, I would wish for their quick recovery. Thank you for once again. Have a nice day. And please, please, please don't try to. I mean, sorry. Please, please, please subscribe my channel and this and this share this video to the maximum people. Thank you. Bye.